Jennifer Carpenter and Pablo Schreiber are no strangers to the gory side of life. She stars in serial killer drama Dexter, and he had a big break on grisly HBO series The Wire. Now they're joining forces at Second Stage Theater for Rajiv Joseph's gruesome playground injuries. Gruesome Playground Injuries is the story of Doug and Kayleen over the course of 30 years of their friendship um, and sort of unrequited uh, love affair. We see them at uh, intervals of 15 years and every time, uh, it jumps forward in time 15 years and then back 10 years every time so it's, it's not uh, told in a linear storytelling fashion. It's about a couple who may or may not be soulmates and they can't quite synchronize and the injuries they inflict on each other and um, uh, the, the wounds that they can't mend for one another sort of get in the way. They could be the link to, for them to connect and they just can't do it. Where does the, the seed for this show come from? Where did it plant in your brain? The, the seed planted in my brain, uh, actually a, a conversation I had with a friend of mine. He was just telling me about all these crazy injuries he had endured over the course of his life. So many, in fact, they seemed to mark the time. And, uh, and when I started thinking about that, I, I, I wondered if a relationship, a story about a relationship could be measured in the same way. And that led me into kind of thinking about both Doug and Kayleen as characters and, uh, and the different sorts of injuries that each of them might go through and how that might connect them or how that might push them away from each other. So you play all these different ages in the show. Do you have a favorite? I think 13 is probably my funnest. Um, there's uh, some, some fun business with uh, bodily fluids that uh, that is, is a lot of fun to play every night. And just the general, just the energy of my character Doug at that age is, is really fun. I think eight is my favorite. It's a great way to start the play because we're eight years old and when you have like really long, like we've had four show weekends, it's like that's what gives me the oomph to start because we get to go kick around as eight year olds for a little while. I just love the relationship. I think it's an incredibly deep and complex and and interesting and unique relationship. You know, the, the, the moment I read it, I thought that uh, Rajiv has just an incredibly unique voice and that the relationship between the two of them was something really, really special. And the fact that the um, injuries play out in a sort of, I, they, they could be taken literally and they are literal in the play, but they're also, you know, metaphorical for, um, metaphoric for um, basically the, what we do to, in uh, the pursuit of love. I like to think about it as like a love, a love story and a story of friends and a story that is, uh, you know, kind of unravels or un unwraps some questions that I have and I think other people might have about, you know, why relationships don't work sometimes and, uh, and why sometimes the people that we love most in the world uh, we can't connect with. And how it worked for me and how I'm hoping it's working for audiences is that you wake up for the next two or three days and it, the play sort of opening up for you, it just keeps... That's the great thing about Rajiv's writing. You can take one sentence, and the one sentence is as beautiful as the whole piece. And um, it's like the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs>